Hi, VJ Bensky here with the first tutorial in a series of how to work in 3D mode in Xsynth. In this tutorial, we will look at how to build a basic 3D layer stack and make some texture changes. To follow along, you will need the asset files included in the Optrix version 2 demo pack. You can find this on the xsynth.org community forum. So let's get started. First, click on 3D mode. Now click Add Layer. Navigate through your layer list. To TV1. Next, click Add Layer. Click Up. TV Antenna. Add Layer again. TV Antenna 2. Add Layer. TV Buttons. Add Layer. TV Screen. Add Layer. There are no more layers. Delete. Okay. And if you press the spacebar, you will see you now have a TV. I'm using the right arrow and left arrow to move around. Now you'll notice some geometry, draw distance strangeness. To correct this, you need to go to each layer and turn on depth sorting and two sided polygons. Do this for each layer depth sorting, two sided polygons, depth sorting, two sided polygons, depth sorting, two sided polygons, depth sorting, two sided polygons. Okay, and now if you press the spacebar, you'll see that your TV. Looks perfect. And that's the basis of building a layer stack in Xsynth. Next I'll show you texturing. So bring the interface back. The texturing is happening here in the material settings. So right now if you come down to the first layer, TV-1, we can change the material of the TV. Simply click IMG for image, double click, and then select a texture for the TV that you like. I quite like this one. So I will now right click and it's been accepted. And it's the same process for any of the other layers that you wish to change. Let's go to the screen. I would like to put a video clip on the screen. So I'm going to select video A. I'm going to double click and then I'm going to choose my movie clip. That one looks good. Right click. Now when I hide the interface by pressing the space bar, I have a video clip playing on the TV. I'm VJ Binsky. Thanks for watching.